Hello everyone, Neil from BookBolt here. Today I want to go over a new feature that we just added to the BookBolt designer, which is going to allow you in one or two clicks to easily create patterns for your book covers. Now, I have been selling a lot of books with patterns on the background, and I'm going to show you exactly how that works today. So, as you see, we are inside of the designer here, and the first step to making a pattern is we need to upload an image. So you can either upload your own image, you can do this with some of the shapes inside of the Book Bolt Designer here. I've already uploaded an image as you see here, so I'm just gonna simply click it. If you did not have an image here, you can pick anything on your desktop, drag it into this little box here, and it will upload it to the designer, which you can then use to create these patterns. So I'm gonna use this rose, and the way we're gonna do this is we are going to resize the rose and just put it anywhere you want. We're just going to put it on the front cover here. You see I've made it a little bit smaller. Now in order for this to work, you need to have the layer selected. So if you go over here to layers, you'll see here's the layer. It is now selected. Go up to the top menu and if you go to the right, you'll see a little pattern box here. You want to click that. Now that's going to allow you to actually create a few patterns. We have grid repeat, vertical bricks repeat, and horizontal bricks repeat. You can play around with these yourself. I really like the vertical bricks repeat here. I'm gonna show you that works. So select the layer, go up here, click on patterns, and then select a pattern that you want. We're gonna click on this one. And there we go. We have a nice pattern for our book cover here. Now, you can crank these out with all of the different vectors you have, but I like to actually come in here. Once I have a pattern on the background, I will go into shapes. I'll come over here and I will select a, uh, a shape over here, we'll put it on the front cover, and I'll make this a little bit bigger. Drag it here, all right? And I might make this a different color. So I'll come up here, maybe select a white, a whitish. And then what I can do is come in here and actually add text. So if you're doing, say, a floral design pattern, this is where I would put the book cover. So I would just say book cover title, all right? Just to make this easy. So we'll take this and I would put the title inside of a box here so it's easy to read and then once you download it you can upload these to KDP you'll have the background and it'll be able to easily see the niche of your book or whatever is inside of your book because you have a little bit of an outline here so it's made readable so that is how to use the pattern designer now one thing I do want to go over real quick before I finish up this video is let's say you have this pattern right here let me get rid of these you have this pattern and let's just say you really don't like it. Now, if you don't like the pattern, the way to clear out all of this is to go to your product tab in the left menu right here. And all you wanna do is click this discard pattern button. It's gonna say, hey, do you wanna discard this pattern? We're gonna say, yes, we do. And it'll come back, discard the pattern and you'll have this single image that you uploaded, which you can then come back up here and try another pattern that we have included. So that's going to wrap up this video. If you guys have any questions or concerns, drop them in the comments, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Thanks.